So, just got a package for my face shop. It just came in, see? I am going to unbox it right now. Stay tuned. Whew. Okay, so, package just came in. I think this is my face shell for my suit, my Spider-Man suit. I ordered a face shell for my, like I said, Raimi Spider-Man suit. Comic-Con this year. Let's get right to the unboxing here. Oh, is this two? Hold on, guys, look at this. See this? There's nothing there. Oh my, there's two face shells. <laughs> oh boy, yeah. So good, this looks better than what it showed in the actual photos from the seller. And shout out to the seller. Oh my God, I'll put up his um uh, his Etsy page. Uh, Cause I ordered this off Etsy. So I'll put his uh, link profile all his uh, stuff, the link to his um, Etsy shop in the description. But oh my, look at this. Oh. So as I mentioned before, right? I ordered just one face shell, which was the first Raimi shell uh, back in late uh, late April. And then I ordered a Taz and two face shell for my brother. And this is it right here. This is why it took so long. It just looks like because the seller had told me that he wanted to ship both of them together since I had actually bought them around the same time. So he just said it just makes more sense to just ship them together. That's why it took a long time. But there's so I still got to add some tidbits to my suit. I got to finish puppy painting. I just got some zippers installed. So that's going to be cool. I took it to a tailor. Let's try it on. I really hope this fits my head too. This actually looks like the color of my suit, so it should be okay. Editing Raymond here. So yes, we discovered quickly that the colors were completely off. We thought about many different ways of how to fix it. And we thought about repainting the entire suit. And it actually worked out in the end. Here are some photos to kind of give you a comparison. There was a lot of orange on the suit, whereas the face shell was a little bit darker. So we had to match the face shell color. And yeah, I mean, after it looks a little bit better, actually matched up. So yeah. The seller actually had two versions of the mask or the face shell. One was a much more updated version, more brighter, but the suit that I have is, the material is a lot darker. So he had this version which kind of matched the look of the darker material of my suit. And so this is the reason why I went with this version. Um, I could show both of the two versions on the screen right here, but yeah, this is it right here. Full force, here we go. Holy crap, it actually fits, there's no way. Hey, it's actually seeable, I won't lie, it's not bad. It's a little bit dark in my room too, so. Wow, there's actually room to like talk. I, I don't know what I look like on camera, like you guys, I'm gonna look in the mirror real quick. <laughs> well, this is it. This is me. Uh, don't have my suit, but this is just the face shell. This feels so freaking cool. You guys literally have no idea. Like, oh my God. Um, this is awesome. This is like everything I could ask for. Um, again, shout out to the seller. This is an amazing job. Literally well-crafted. It fits so nice, like I have so much room within the face shell to talk. Like I have a lot of room to breathe. And speaking of breathing, these lenses are actually, they're supposed to be breathable lenses. It won't get, they're anti-fog lenses, so they won't, every time I'm talking or breathing, the lenses won't fog up, so. Okay, so it looks like they are magnetic, which is really interesting. Okay, so looks like it just kind of latches on. Man, this is really hard to see. I'm using my, so I don't, I can't really see myself right now, but hang on. <laughs> okay, so yeah, they kind of like pop off and on, but yeah, that's really cool. Um, whew, okay, I'm back, I'm back. Guys, this is it. This is it right here. This is what the inside looks like if you guys are curious. You can see, it's handcrafted. Um, they did a really amazing job. I can't, 
I can't stress it enough. It's it's so well it's so well crafted. Like I I love the webbing, the web pattern. I can't even tell if this was puppy painted or not, but it does smell like puppy paint. So so cool. I can't I can't get over it. This is my first face shell ever. Yeah, this is pretty much it right here. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the unboxing. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.